Mirror Distortion versus Photo, and Image Perspective. Hello there, curious minds. In today's video, we'll be exploring an interesting topic. How can a mirror distort an image compared to a photo? This comparison dives deep into the fascinating world of optics, perception, and photography. So, let's dive in. How does a mirror reflect an image? First things first, let's understand how a mirror reflects an image. A mirror reflects light in a way that preserves much of its original quality. It follows the law of reflection, which states that the angle of incidence is equal to the angle of reflection. This gives us a direct, real-time reflection of objects placed in front of it. However, there is a key characteristic of mirrors that we often overlook. Mirrors provide us with a laterally inverted image. What's left in the real world appears right in the mirror and vice versa. But since we're used to seeing our reflections in mirrors, our brains automatically adjust for this lateral inversion and we perceive the reflection as normal. How does a photo represent an image? Moving on, let's understand how a photo represents an image. When a picture is taken, the camera captures light from the scene and records it on a film or digital sensor. This image is not laterally inverted, and hence, when we look at a photo, it appears as others see us in the real world. Unlike mirrors, photos give us a static, permanent representation of a moment in time. Photos can also be manipulated and edited, which could result in distortions or changes in how the original scene appeared. How can a mirror distort an image compared to a photo? Now, on to the crux of our discussion. How can a mirror distort an image compared to a photo? Firstly, the type of mirror used can cause distortion. For example, a flat mirror will reflect an undistorted image, whereas a curved mirror, like a funhouse mirror, will distort the image by magnifying or shrinking parts of it. Secondly, the mirror's quality can also play a part. Imperfections in the mirror, such as a warped or bumpy surface, can cause distortions in the reflected image. Lastly, as we've discussed, mirrors provide a laterally inverted image compared to photos, which might be considered a form of distortion since it doesn't represent the real-world orientation of objects. And there you have it, the interesting ways in which a mirror can distort an image compared to a photo. From lateral inversion to the distortion effects of curved mirrors, we've delved into the fascinating differences between these two modes of image representation. I hope this has been as interesting for you as it was for me. Thanks for joining, and keep exploring the world with your inquisitive minds.